Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back. What we are doing is we're doing our Assassin's Creed Black Flag and we have just exited the Animus. I'll meet you by the elevator. I saw them asking me questions. Yeah, they confiscated my Animus key and now my position here is under review. Are you kidding? That's... That's scary. What? An animus under review. Hopefully, man is an under review. Under you, we've only four. Oh, sorry. <laughs> we've only four trophies. Over here. Are you ready? He's waiting for us. Uh, yeah, sure. I'm actually kind of excited to see what this trailer is. I just watched some of your footage from this week. It's amazing. Blackbeard was mental. And we all got so excited that we started talking about this idea for a trailer about him. Maybe start with him drinking, talking to some pirates, telling a story. Okay, that gave me a bit of goosebumps. <laughs> We cut to him leaping across the deck of his boat and, sorry, his ship, not boat, but jumping around the deck of his ship, swinging from ropes and fighting like a devil. I mean, obviously we're gonna have to manipulate some of the existing footage to get it looking good, but it could be great. I'm getting a shiver in my timbers just thinking about it. <laughs> sorry. It's okay. Ma'am? Bonjour, ça va? I hope we're not late. No, you can go right. Hi, Melanie. I saw you just walked in. I need a few minutes with you alone. Leticia is on the phone and we're discussing the Gunway project. Oh, yes, of course. Sorry about this. I'll call you when we're ready. What can I not go in? Shouldn't be long. I want to go in. Hello? Hello? Do you have a second? Of course you do. Head to the waypoint on your map. I have another job for you. I'd like to link all the cameras in the building to a central monitoring system, but most aren't calibrated correctly. Okay. Another locked door. Not a problem. Voila. You now have level two security clearance. Not bad for your first few weeks. Find first. the camera control station first. How long was I in there? Well, before I do, I want to... I'll update your communicator. Well, I'm not... I'm not doing that yet, mate. Let's have a look around. Oh, even! <laughs> Just have a... Oh, is that the construction site where uh, Desmond climbs on in Assassin's Creed 3, I think? remember. I just remember that there was a time where Dead Mouth could climb a thing. He was actually out on the field for once. And here we go. Oh, this is an interesting security measure. It looks like you need to find the right combination of numbers to adjust the weight. Easy enough, right? Pick a number selector, then change its value. Once you find the right combination of numbers, you should get access. Okay, thank you. Target number three. Oh, 
Oh, what the? This is moths. So then, there we are. Who's times? So two times, five times, seven, something. Also, you have to do two times five, which is ten, then times seven, because you could. Come on. Think you're talking to? The hell you on me? Hey, want me to jump? Huh? Is that what you want? Up off the terrace? How, how do I do that? Oh, I wanna. <sighs> oh, well done, kiddo. Find his computer, make it snappy. We're looking for the shareholders' meeting schedule. It's worth a lot of money to us. I just wonder now, they not curious that I'm not even in the room anymore. Stressful. <laughs> uh, uh, I'm just going to be reading this in my head.
Oh wow, I've just realised that there's a lot. So I'll just show little bits. If you just want, pause it and read through it. I'm just quickly getting little details. Ninjas and zombies. <laughs> That's awesome. The CTOS Dream the Bloom program, wow. Yeah, watch those. <laughs> first okay how do I Again, just pause it and read through it if you want to. I'm just going to keep on tapping it down. Now I've got a lot of reading to do when this video is over. <laughs> supposed to be um, seeing this new trailer
like the ammo, Jay? I practiced. I think you pulled it a little too long. Oh, come on. It's not encrypted code, for God's sakes. It's just a bloody coffee. Oh, hooray! It's our old friend. Hey there. I just got a call about picking up another transfer. Oh? You said you were here to see me. Yes, that is one of the perks. Let's see it. Hmm. A conference in Chicago. Very nice. Thanks for this. We'll be in touch. Ciao, Rebecca. Text me. Stuff it, Hastings. <laughs> exactly. Well done, friend. Very well done. Apologies for my temper of tantrum there. You are with the good guys, I promise. We'll keep you safe. Trust me. Go on back to work. We'll be in touch. Trust you. You want me to trust you after you just yelled at me? How my feelings? <laughs> Mine? Three times between the parking lot. Scum. Let's have a look here. So, 100. Again, I thought she was supposed to tell me, oh yeah, we're ready to show you the trailer. Two. 
two, three, four, five trophies. This is Desmond. Okay. P out of thirty three. Well, that's all. You just give them like a drop of your blood, and then you can see what your ancestors were. Cool. How many trophies do you have? One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, that was lucky. <laughs> Where is the people? Researchers looked into the life of Altair Ibn Lahad, hoping to find a biography that might serve as a positive role model for Abstergo's global outreach programs. Unfortunately, this renegade assassin proved to be no such thing. In much of his footage, we see a man gleefully flouting some of his culture's most entrenched taboos with an arrogance that borders on messianic. Altair, no, this is not our way. To burn a man's body is forbidden. <coughs> Many of our researchers felt that the arguments articulated by Altair's rival, a man known as Abbas, were clearer and more cogent than any we heard from Altair. I recently put in a request that more effort be dedicated to locating one of Abbas's descendants, if any exist. 
It's clear to us that Altair's transgressions were the primary motivation behind the ultimate dissolution of his despicable order by the middle of the 13th century. We therefore strongly recommend a pass on this property in favor of a more agreeable and inspiring figure from this era. <laughs> wow. <laughs> To you sneaky sticky note. Just making sure I haven't left anything Okay, I didn't know I could get in here. Didn't even know this room existed. still in 18th century Hungary? No. His connection is so stable, he's jumped between a few ancestors today. We're in 15th century France now. Turns out he's related to one of Joan of Arc's executioners. <laughs> Surprise. Uh, Eileen, yesterday Vidic asked me to help him work out some of the bugs in his audiovisual renderer, uh, and I told him... No, no, no. Come on, Satish, not you. It wouldn't be permanent. Uh, a few months at most. Months? That will kill every ounce of momentum we have. It won't, I promise. Honestly, I think this could help us. If, if I can get a look at what these people are doing, we could... Come on. He's trying to pull you over to his side. Don't you see that? He's luring you with quick victory and prestige. That's not what this is about, honestly. I need to get back to work. Eileen, I'm sorry. Do what you must. I'll survive. Test session 32, April 2nd, 1981. Host Eileen Bach. 
DNA sample SV1970. Miriam. Miriam, are you awake? What? Miriam, they're coming for me. Who oh, is it? The guards? I see them from my window, amassing in the courtyard. My time is up. Basil, don't say this. You don't know that. Forgive me for this, Miriam. But I must tell you something. The artifact. We have it. But only Oscar and I know its location. Don't tell me. They will release you. Your family has connections. You must take the artifact and bring it to the assassins in Paris. Please don't. I don't want to know. It's safer if I don't. Hush now. If I die, knowledge of its location dies with me. You must bring it to the assassins. Assassins? I don't understand. The spy of St. Petrus. No, I don't want to hear. Sam, seven. Seven. It's you. Sorry, you just sound exhausted. Did I wake you? No, no, I'm... I've just been busy. It sounds like it. I'm just a little tired, that's all. No, I mean, your your project sounds fascinating. Your colleague, Dr. Warren Vidic, he called me recently and he told me what you've been up to. He what? Warren? Yeah, he told us about your research, memories, ancestry, all of that. He even asked if we'd be willing to come in and... No! Jesus, no! What the hell is he doing? Eileen, it's okay. We signed some papers, non-disclosure stuff. No! He's trying to fuck me over! Damn it! Eileen, we just talked about my mother. Just like you and I did. World War II. That's all. It's the artifact. The what? Carl, if he calls you again, you tell him you work through me, okay? That's it. Vidic has been a pain in my ass for years. And I don't need him getting all the glory for my two years of hard work. All right. Uh, so how should I go about this? I mean, the wheels are in motion. I... I don't know. Just go through me if he contacts you again. Please? All right. You'll do that? Of course. Yes. Thank you, Carl. I'm sorry I was short with you. I've just been exhausted. That's all. It's all right, hon. Just... just take care of yourself. Morning, Eileen. We're almost ready. Just a few more adjustments. Hmm. Okay. I had the team do some research on this artifact we've been chasing, and it appears the Third Reich actually found something matching its description sometime in 1940. Uh, Eileen, are you all right? Sorry, yeah. I'm fine. Just a little... scattered. Biddick called my ex-husband last night. He wants to put him in the Animus. To find the artifact before us? Exactly. Well, it would be fast using Vidic's animus. And maybe that would get us back to our original work. Satish, if we let that happen, then all our money dries up. Lillian is paying for us to find the artifact, not improve our methods. Do you understand? Right, of course. I'm sorry. Let's just... let's just burn those bridges when we cross them. Are we ready? Yes, just a few more adjustments, Senorian. I made a small change to the genetic input modulator. I'm hoping that buys us a few more minutes. Even a few seconds would be nice. I'm ready. All right. Settle in. Oh, yes. Okay. Uh, hope you all have enjoyed <laughs> Um, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe if you're not subscribed, and I will see you all in the next video. I'll be hacking a few more computers, collecting these. And the next video, you will see me hop back into the Arrows. Again, hope you all enjoyed. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe if you're not subscribed, and I will see you all. In the next video, this room is really small. I'm guessing this must be like an admin's room or something. Bye guys. <laughs>